Hi everyone. Happy New Year. I'm coming to you today with the second half of my Christmas haul and my New Year's Eve look. So um, I'm going to try and post it today, which is New Year's Eve, but we will see if I have time. Um, so I have a whole bag of stuff that I'm going to be going through and showing some of which I will be getting to use today, and some I will use in another video. So I'm going to start with my most favorite thing that I'm the most excited about. This is the Urban Decay Full Spectrum Palette. This is from my husband. I mean, right? Look at that. That's beautiful. <laughs> I'm so excited. I mean, it's got, it's got like dark shimmers and then it has like mostly matte with like just a little bit of shimmer and then lighter shimmers at the bottom. This is just amazing. I just love this palette. Okay. So that's that. And then I got another Urban Decay. This is from my mother-in-law. It's the Vice Lipstick Palette. It says lipstick is my vice. And these are all lipsticks. Even this green. <laughs> it's pretty crazy, right? <laughs> I don't think I'm going to do green today, but. Hmm. It's pretty well pigmented. <laughs> so, um. That'll be fun. So I will be using that for sure. What else did I get? This is just a... It brushes for Ulta. And I just got a little, little pack of brushes from my uh, stepmother. So I'm excited about that. Actually, um, this looks like kind of a good brush for highlight. It's probably a, well, it says it's a foundation brush, but I use usually bigger, flatter brushes for highlight, I mean for foundation. So that might be good for highlight. And this is a good shadow brush. I don't have one like this. I have similar, but not quite like this. It's like pretty sturdy. But it's like a good shape for a crease. And then this is the powder. And it's very soft. So I'll, I'll give that a try. Okay. These are also from my stepmom. These are just mini, I think they're mini beauty blenders. They're called makeup erasers. But they're they're kind of a good good size. 
they can get on in there. All right, that's that's a quality thing to have. I don't know why that's in this bag. <laughs> Hand sanitizer. My husband bought me one of these. I'm, I'll use it in another video. It's a pearl face mask for perfecting and brightening. Cleansing cloth. These are from my sister-in-law, and I think they're really cool. These are called wine wine lip tints, and they're in a wine bottle. Let's try this out, shall we? very subtle but it will stay on it's really cool um, I'm not really sure what this is rosebud salve bomb oh I guess it's lip balm I'm very excited about this. This is um, Peter Thomas Roth 24 Karat Gold Pure Luxury Lift and Firm Prism Cream. Look at that. I'll definitely be using that. And, oh, I forgot there's another of these lip tints. like wine but they taste nice this is um, a lighter color obviously and finally that I'm very touched by this because I got this perfume in an ipsy or a birch box I forget which and I think when I first sprayed it on I was like oh it kind of smells like baby powder and baby diapers <laughs> But actually, the more it stayed on me, the more I was like, I really like this. And I was, I just like happened to comment on it and I like let my husband smell it and he smelled it and he was like, oh yeah, that's nice. And so he like went in the trash and found the Ipsy bag so he could know what kind it is and then got me this. So this is Lalia Dream White Tea and Honeysuckle. And... It does kind of smell like baby wipes and baby powder when you first smell it, <laughs> spray it on. But it actually smells really, really nice as it kind of fades. So I'm going to start with a little of this um, Blue Lagoon moisturizer because my face has been feeling very dry. I know I said that in my last video. reading the instructions on this. I think I should put on regular concealer and powder first. So where is my concealer and powder? 
that would be a good question to ask. and with my fingers. I'm going to make sure I don't have streakies anywhere. Okay, that's pretty good. And then I will use new brush with my Maybelline powder. Let's go in with some of this. Really get that powder in there. I really like the shape of this. You can really get in. Anastasia palette. to kind of go on the top and the bottom to sort of blend. Okay. And... Oh, no. Do a combo of my favorite blushes.
that's pretty good. But it feels like I need to sort of set it, so I'm just gonna go in with the other side of this and my Nikki tutorials highlighter. I want to have like streaky lines. Now that's a bright highlight. Indeed. Right. I'm going to just use some of this Urban Decay Primer Potion in Sin. This is old. I haven't used it in a while. Oh. <laughs> I just got a look at the face. Okay. It's way too much. are freaking out right now probably because it hurts my hurts my soul a little bit and do that okay all right so let's get started with some of this guy shade. So I'm going to start with this color Iced and put that in the upper lid area. You can't really see it that much. It's very soft and light. And I'm going to go in with Bump. Bump like because it looks like cocaine. I guess. Isn't that special? Back in with the iced. Okay. I think I'm going to do this teal color because it's calling my name. It's calling me. And I'm going with this nice stiff brush. a really stiff brush. I'm just building that color up. This brush does not make blending super easy, but it gives you really nice control. So if you want to like stay clean in your crease, it's good for that. And now I'm just going to continue to build up, build up the color. Just take this one again and go back in with this iced color as a blender. There is a 
actually a brush that comes with this palette too, which is looking pretty cool. I'm going to try to use it for this color mean. Yes. God, it is so hard to find a good lime green. Probably should have put some white primer under that, but I don't think I have to. I'm just really packing that on. This Urban Decay brush, I'm going to go into this color Gold Mine. And go in, oh! <laughs> go in the inner corner with that. blindsided color. That's pretty nice. I want to do more colors, but I think I should keep it sort of simple. And she'll just have to come back for more videos. Okay. I will go in with my trusty brow pencil from Benefit. Flick. A very thin line over here because I like this gold, gold and lime green and I don't want to cover it. Oh, I'm gonna have a jaundice look.
was the weirdest application of eyeliner I've ever done. Why is it being weird? eyeliner starting to dry out. I think that's part of the problem. No. Where is my mascara? Mm -hmm. No mascara here. This room is absolutely out of control. Um, yeah, I can't find any. Is there mascara in here? There is. Yay. I'm gonna do some false lashes because that is fun. And I'm just using these ones by Elevation Lashes. Oops, gluing some glue onto it. I still have a little bit of glitter on them. And that was kind of fun. I don't really know when the last time I wore them was, but I must have been wearing glitter. Up, oh, up, oh, up, oh, nope, 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 nope. These never sit quite right. There we go. Got that on. I just have a really weird shaped eye. Do you ever feel like that when you try to put on false eyelashes? This one I'm better. Okay, while those are drying, I'm gonna go in and see what I can do with this lip palette. Very excited about it. It has a 
has this little brush. <laughs> Use some of this already. And I think I'm going to go in with. Hmm. I'm going to try this Firebird color and then I'm going to put this sparkly one over top. Stick on with a brush. It's so much better. It goes like right where you tell it to go. So that's pretty neon. <laughs> I'm going to actually go into this speedball color. Which is a little darker. pretty cool. And then I'm going to go in with this color, which is very bright and sparkly in the center. So um, I think that's pretty cool and I'm feeling good about all the new things I can do, but I feel like there's one thing missing still from this look. This is definitely running out of running out of itself.
So it says 2017 on my face. <laughs> it's not backwards, is it? I can't tell. I'll have to ask somebody because I'm looking in a mirror and in a video, which is weird. I might have to redo it. But anyway, I hope that you enjoyed this video. These lashes are weird. There we go. And if there's anything else you'd like to see, let me know. And otherwise, I will see you next time. Okay, bye.